Assalamu alaikum. This is uh, Rana Mohammad Awais from Mind Strong Engineering. Uh, I am unboxing this Strata Kit IOLing Master by IFM. Uh, IOLing is basically a standardized point to point technology for interfacing sensors and actuators. It uses a Profinet communication interface that can be easily linked with our existing PLC, HMI, SCADA, or AMIA systems. Uh, regarding this product, uh, so this is uh, IOLing Master by IFM. They are different manufacturers, however, we are partners with IFM, so uh, we are going to display and use their product. Uh, this product is fairly new for Pakistan if you talk about the local industries here. However, technology uh, has been implemented and used over the time. Uh, for this design, they have an attractive product design, I must say and they have uh, posted all their components uh, over to the box as well there's a background picture over there of an industry here is the website uh, which you can visit and check multiple uh, products over there they are they are providing quite a vast range of industrial products including this one uh, there's a tag over here that says close to you uh, so let's uncover this product and see what are they using this <clears throat> so first of all they have provided me this uh, brochure or a flyer use you can say uh, so this is the kit we are using it says ioning master standard line <coughs> coolant so they are providing four port ioling master with profinet interface so they are port po four ports where I can connect my sensors and actuators uh, and there's a plug-in power supply for uh, 230 volt 24 volts so we are using in Pakistan uh, 230 volt so that won't be a problem LR device USB stick so this is a parameter setting software uh, where we can configure our uh, sensors or actuators uh, in this kit we have photoelectric ioling distance sensor a range up to 200 centimeter and we have a uh, we have an ethernet cable m m12 connector on one side and rj45 connector on the other side and a sensor cable uh, for our photoelectric uh, distance sensor <clears throat> so further specification is mentioned over here operating voltage ioning version which one can read <clears throat> for uh, in detail So on the <coughs> inside the box, they have further mentioned the components included in the box. So from here, I can pull this. Again, uh, I like the design of uh, this box. So let's keep it at the side. So let's have a look at what these components look like. This is the IOLing device. Uh, I believe color is very attractive and again a sleek design so we have M12 connectors over there we have two profinet ports on which we can connect our multiple IOLing devices or we can connect our <coughs> PLC modules as well PLC HMI SCART or MES modules we have power connector over there where we can plug our power connect uh, power plug we have four ports of for connecting our sensors and actuators uh, best part is that uh, a single port can be used to connect uh, in input or output i mean uh, sensor or actuator both or it can be used for both analog and digital signals as well so this is our main device we have this distance sensor over there that can sense the range up to 200 meters uh, sorry 200 centimeters and again, uh, it has an Amtrof connector. Uh, we have this power uh, module, power adapter to power up our IOLing starter kit. Uh, this is Ethernet uh, connector, RJ45 connector at one end and m connector at other end. So by this cable, we can um, connect our IOLing device to our computer. Uh, this is the uh, M12 connector cable for our distance sensor that we can connect this sensor to our 
iOS device. Okay, so this is the USB uh, which has LR software. LR software can, is a parameter configuration software uh, using which we can configure our sensors and actuators. So by using this software, we can uh, change settings of our sensors and without uh, touching it or configuring it in physically. So these are all the components that include are including iPhone I/O Link Starter Kit, and we are uh, soon going to be posting its tutorials as well. How can we use it? How can we uh, this technology can benefit our industry, and how this technology can further improve productivity in our systems. Thank you.